The medium is fluted and glued to one of the liners at the single facer. The preheated and moistened medium travels first through the corrugating nip between the two corrugating rolls. The corrugating rolls have alternating ridges and grooves, which mesh together like gears as they meet in the nip to form the flutes in the medium. After the corrugating nip, the medium is held against the second corrugating roll, either by thin metal plates called fingers, vacuum supplied to the inside of a perforated corrugating roll, or a pressurized chamber that presses the medium up against a solid corrugating roll. As the fluted medium approaches the nip with the pressure roll, a glue roll applies adhesive to the outer tips of the flutes. The preheated liner enters from the other side of the single facer. It contacts the fluted medium in the single facing nip between the pressure roll and the second corrugating roll. It is the heat and pressure present in this nip that are responsible for the bond that must hold the medium and liner together until the bond can fully cure. The strength of this initial green bond depends on the adhesive formula, adhesive application, and time and temperature in the single-facing nip.